it's really bad. And then think about her kid and think about everybody that's going to miss her. It's a lot. Only on six, family and friends of Amber Collins say they will be at every court hearing for the man accused of killing her. They tell News on Six is Aaron Conrad they're struggling to understand how an argument escalated to murder. Aaron. Well, Terry and Craig, those closest to Amber want answers out as to how this happened. And they want to know how someone so loved by so many could have been killed by someone who knew her. Family and friends of Amber Collins are still reeling after the news of her death. Jared Barrera has known Amber since she was in high school and says she was like family. My wife hasn't went a day without crying. It's hard for me to sit here and talk about it. It's just bad. Investigators say Amber and her friend Priscilla Ochoa were shot and killed over the weekend while at a Cinco de Mayo party. Rolando Morales is behind bars, accused of both murders. It's just senseless, senseless. According to police, Morales claimed during his interview that he fought with the two women. Police say Morales claims that's why he shot them. Friends tell us that can't be true. She's just always looking out for the kids first, and that's why I know the guy's lying about saying she was wanting the kid to go get alcohol. That's a lie. Amber was a mother herself. And friends say she always put family first. First thing she'd do is hop on my wife's lap with my wife screaming, you're too big to be on my lap, Amber. And just she'd say, I don't care. I just need to be loved. And my wife would love on everyone that met her, knew her, and liked her. Now family and friends say they don't know what's next and don't know how to accept that their Amber is gone. I can't forgive him or forget about it. Rolando Morales is here in the Tulsa County Jail on two complaints of first degree murder and one complaint of arson for setting the victim's car on fire. For now, we're live on the scene on the story in Tulsa. Aaron Conrad, News on 6.